Good morning, everybody. Mike Vaki, Princeton Trader here from Mr. Top Step with your Friday morning pre-market webcast. Okay, I got a 15-minute chart of the ES, and you know, effectively, what we did yesterday is we got a little bit of news, and you see over here, you know, what can happen if you're a bear with no conviction whatsoever is you can basically get spooked at the drop of a hat, and the market goes up 10, 15 handles. Uh, we rallied because apparently the Spanish budget was better than what the EU was looking for and I mean I, I guess that's a reason to rip 15 handles I don't really yeah I think if everybody would have taken a deep breath it probably wouldn't have but that's the issue with this market it's it's it illustrates what I've been talking about perfectly the bears have no conviction they have been beaten on so severely over the last two to three years the slightest move, the slightest move scares them out. And when that happens, you get this kind of short squeeze. This is just a short squeeze. There's no actual buying in here. I mean, it's, it's, this is everybody This is everybody being too short and freaking out. Um, so into today, you got the nine day or up here at 1442 half. You've got a shorter term fib level up here at 1446, and I've been looking at 4647 all the time because that old bracket of 1458 to 1448.47 had been important for so long. We lost that down to 24. So to come back up to test the bottom of that bracket is is completely reasonable from a technical analysis perspective. It's what happens after that. Now, on the bullish side, the the bulls have gotten back the middle Bollinger Band. Let me get these fibs out of here. The bulls got back the middle band. They lost it and got it back. Now, we're sitting back on it again. The middle Bollinger Band today comes in at about 1438 and we're trading 1438. So the battle over the middle band is not over. Uh, we'll have to see how the day plays out. So 1438, you really got to circle that number on your charts as a potential support or resistance level. I, I'm hesitant to call it a point of control, but it is significant. Um, okay, back to the 15. Well, we're selling off a little bit here down to the daily pivot. You've got 1440 is a key level. You got the three-day pivot there and a, a Fibonacci level. You've got doubles down here at 1434. Uh, that we could see on a pullback. I think if this gets any real momentum though, let me back out one. This gets any real momentum, you've got to be looking at 1430 and then 1424. On the upside, you got to look at 46 and 50 to 51, which is double fibs up there. Okay? So everybody have a fantastic day and a great weekend. Mike Vaki, Princeton Trader from Mr. Top Step. I'll be back tomorrow uh, I'll be back Monday morning with another webcast. Trade them well everybody.